channel. My name is Melissa and you're watching Fashion at 50. I want to welcome you. If you're new here, I do hope that you subscribe and hit the notification bell down below. I always link my sizes in the box below. And if I can find the items that I'm going to be trying on, I will link them down there as well. I want to say a happy belated 4th of July. I hope everyone stayed safe and had a wonderful time. I had the most amazing 4th of July that I have ever, ever had. The apartment that I live in, I started out the day by going yard selling. For those of you who love yard selling, it is amazing. And then we went to the lake and spent a couple of hours, and that was the first time I've done that this year. And then we come home, took our showers, and got ready and we were supposed to have went to a cookout but something happened that we didn't get to go so we stayed home and sat on the back deck and in every direction you could see fireworks and it was like they were all competing you know who has the highest and the loudest and it was the best firework show i have ever seen in my entire life so yeah i was super super excited i never wanted it to end Okay, in this video, we're going to be talking about Ellos. It's E-L-L-O-S. I thought I would try some of their items, and uh, there were some cute things that I really, really wanted. And uh, <clears throat> just to add to my everyday attire and to go with outfits. So, other than that, I got two or three things, and we're going to go on and go through them. And then I'll try them all on, and we'll see how they fit. So, stay tuned. I've got a bump in the corner of my mouth that is killing me. I don't know. No, it's not herpes. Just saying. Okay, the first item I'm super excited about, it is kind of loungewear, or you can dress it up, dress it down. It is in a size 22-24, and that is a 1X with L-O-S, E-L-L-O-S. And I have actually wore this. I wore it with a pair of cropped white jeggings. But it's this blouse tunic style. It has buttons down the front, and you can't even see. But it has buttons down the front, and the collar I like because it's not actual a collar per se, but I like how that is. I love the sleeves and the shoulders, and they are three quarter inch sleeves, and they have a little button on this side, right there. And the bottom is like a high-low. So that is super cute. It's nice and flowy. It doesn't have stretch to it, really. But let me see if I can't find what the material is. It's always on one side or the other. It is 100% cotton. I should have known that. But yeah, it doesn't have no stretch to it. And it probably will shrink. I haven't worn it since I've washed it. But when I washed it, I hung it up to dry. So hopefully it didn't shrink none. But I think it's super cute. I will try to pair it with the white cropped jeggings that I wore with it the first time. So yeah, stay tuned and see what this looks like. This is how I paired or would pair the tunic. It's super flowy. It doesn't have no stretch, but I love how it has this little pleat and the faux buttons. Or actually, they're not faux buttons. They are real buttons. Then it has the three quarter inch sleeves and it has a button where you can roll them up even further if you'd like. But I love the color detail. Super cute. And I wore it with these cropped white stretchy pants. And I love how it has the high low. Super cute. This is the back. And I paired it with my little red slap shoes is what I call it. But I just think it's a cute little outfit and it's very, very comfortable. And summery too. I feel cute in it. 
you guys tell me which outfit you like the best in the comments below. Okay, the next item is a sundress. And I know it's not really what you say summery, but then again it is. It is a smocked sundress. It has adjustable straps, which is a plus. It has the smocking all the way around the top part where the breast goes. Then it has a midi length, I think it's what you call it, mini or midi length bottom to it. And I love the black with the florals, the purple and the cream and the greens. It is amazing. And this one's in a 22-24, which is a 1X for Illos. So watch your sizes because if you get a 2X, that would be a 26-28. So that would be way too big. So watch your sizing on Illos. But I love how the straps are adjustable. And they're not real wide. I wish they were a little wider so you could wear a regular bra. But it's okay. I don't hate it for that. But yeah, I'm going to try this on and we're going to see how it looks. I'm super excited. This is the sundress. Is it not adorable? And it is so comfortable. It has the adjustable straps. I absolutely love it. It comes right below the knee or the calf, whatever you call that thing. <laughs> but yeah, super cute. This is the back. I love it. You guys tell me what you think. It is so comfortable, nice and flowy, makes you feel like a girly girl. But you tell me what you guys think. Okay, this next item is a cute little top. I'm kind of wondering, I got it in a large, which is an 1820 with Ellos. I love the detail from the top. It has no sleeves. It flares out like shark bite, shark bite on the edges, which is super cute detail. It's just plain Jane in the back. That's the bottom. And I see a hair on it. But anyway, I love the detail up front. So I can't wait to try this one on. I wish I had went ahead and... I don't remember them having it. I bet they didn't have it in an extra large. It would have just been a 1X, 22, 24. But I wished I had have gotten it in a 1X. There must have been a reason why I didn't. Maybe they were out. But yeah, super cute. I thought this would be so cute to wear it with some jean shorts, jean Bermuda shorts particularly, and a pair of black flats or black wedges, something like that. And then, or you can dress it up and wear it with, I have that black and white striped mini skirt. Wear it with that and some little wedges or flats or something. I think that you can dress it both ways and or you can wear it under a cardigan something like that and show this detail up front but gorgeous I can't wait to try this on and see how it's gonna fit this is the black one with the kind of a lace crochet embroidery look I don't know what you call that but I absolutely love it and the little detail here around the neck, you can see that really plain. Has like the shark bike bottom, and it goes all the way around to the back. And I just think it's cute to pair with just a pair of distressed shorts, Bermuda shorts, and then wear a pair of little white uh, wedges. I mean, not white, but black wedges, or some black flats, or even these black kids to dress it down. But put on a little bit of jewelry and you can dress it up. I think it's amazing. And this one was in the 1820 in a large. I kind of wish I'd got it bigger, but I like it the way it is, too. You guys tell me what you think. I love this detail right here. Okay, this next item 
I got in on 1X, 2224, and that is really, really bothering me. And it's another little Kimmy top. The straps are not adjustable on this one, but I like how it's got just a slight V-neck to it. It's no sleeves. It does flare out like kind of like a baby doll style, but it doesn't have the pleats in the front. But it's this black with white. -ish. It's not really squares, but with a black detail to it. I thought this would be cute to wear with some white cropped sh uh, leggings or some white shorts or even jeans. Or you could wear it over a bathing suit and um, just to get there to the lake or have a picnic, something like that when you're at the lake. Super cute. I purchased a black pair of shorts to go with this, so hopefully it fits, and I don't know if I will try on a strapless bra to try on these things with. I don't know. I'm not sure. So stay tuned and see if I did. This is how I would pair this one. It fits amazing. It does come a little lower here than I like and I'm so white under the arms but yeah and it's kind of a high low as well or it's just where my boobs pull it up <laughs> but I would match it with these white cropped pants I just think it's cute and I do have a regular bra on it's a nude color you could almost wear it like that and I love this slight V that it has but yeah super cute outfit and this is the back you guys tell me if you like this one the best I like it I feel so girly in all these things like it like it like it and I got two more outfits to show you. No, three more outfits to show you. Love the top. Love it. Okay, this next item I got two of, and they're in a size 1X, 22, 24, but they're different colors. I've got a black one, and it's just a piece that I wanted it to add to my wardrobe to wear underneath cardigans and shawls and uh, blazers and things like that but it has the wide band which i love it has this lace detail up at the top so you can wear it underneath things that you need to uh, um, hide your breast area so i thought it'd be super cute for that and then the bottom has the lace as well so you could wear another shirt over this and I'll just let the lace at the bottom of this show Super cute, super cute there. But yeah, we are going to see how this looks. I may pair it with something and get an idea of how I'm going to wear this and give you guys some ideas. And then I got a white one, same size. No, it's not. The white one I got in a large, and I know why I did, because I wanted it to fit a little tighter to go underneath a dress that I got from Forever 21. Yeah, I had to think there for a minute. But yeah, I wanted to wear it under a dress that I got from Forever 21. Probably what I wish, probably what I will have wished, will have wished is that I got this one in a large as well. But remember, the larges are 1820 and they're 1X is 22-24. So, you know, just be remindful of their sizing. But this is, in the material, stretchy, super soft, too. But yeah, let's go on to the next item. Alright, this is one of the items. And it's this white cami. And this is why I bought it, was to wear under this dress, because I didn't like how low this one was. But I'll show you the, this in another video that will be coming up soon. 
but I just love the detail of the lace. I wish this little piece right here would not flip like it does. But other than that, I just absolutely love it. And I paired it with this dress, and I've got the cute little, um, whatever you call them, <laughs> on. And I, I just think this is so summery. Do you not believe this, how summery this is in the color? And I just run into my dresser. But it is super cute. Sorry it cuts off my head. But yeah, absolutely love it. It's so slenderizing, if that's even a word. Absolutely love it. So girly. I like it, I like it a lot. Okay, this next item I actually got for the 4th of July and didn't wear it because I ended up wearing the red, white, and blue traditional colors for 4th of July. This I got in a 1X, 2224, and it's this black tee, capped sleeves, and it has this star. Is that not gorgeous? That would be so cute with some jean shorts or some cropped jeans and a pair of little black kids. I think it's adorable. I can't wait. There's the bottom. I can't wait to try this on and see how it actually looks on me. I'm not much for cat sleeves, the shorter sleeves, you know, like what I'm wearing now, but I make it work. It is what it is. There ain't no sense in trying to hide what you know you've already got, you know. But yeah, super cute. Be comfortable with who you are. That's the main my main saying and it is what it is so i've got one more item to show you that i will pair with this top let's see what that is and then this tank top or t-shirt absolutely love it the sleeves are a little shorter than what i like but i love the u-neck and the star i absolutely love and black kind of camouflages you and makes you look slimmer all black is amazing this is how I would pair this together. So you guys tell me in the comments below which one you like the best, which outfit. Yeah, I like it. I wouldn't mind having this in different colors. And I think it does come in different colors. And you can get some with hearts on it as well. Super cute. Alright, the last item I got in a size... 18 and it is 66% cotton, 32% polyester, and 2% my head's itching, and 2% spandex. No, I don't have lice. The biggest detail that I loved about these and why I purchased them is the button fly all the way up. I love button fly. I just love it. I don't know what it is, but I feel like it cinches you in more which it don't, but I just feel like it does. It has pockets in the front, and it has pockets in the back. The only thing that I'm not keen on is the fact that it has the cuffed legs, and they're not tacked at all. But if you wanted to, you could unroll them and have the distressing at the bottom and make them more like Bermuda style. We, when we try them on, we will leave one road and one unrolled and see how both of them look. Then if I like them better road, I will probably use that double-sided tape. For those of you who have never used that double-sided tape, it is a magical wonder. It works amazingly. The only thing is after four or five washes, it does lose its stickiness and you have to reapply. But yeah, and it's very inexpensive too at Walmart. But yeah, we are going to try these on. In the pockets too, I like the little detail of these little stones here, rhinestone, whatever you call them things. Eyelets, maybe, eyelets maybe. But, and it's got them on the front too, and they match. And also, another little detail is these, I don't know if you can see it or not. These have, a star on the button. I don't know. If, I don't think you can see it. 
they have a star on each one of these buttons. I don't know if you can see it or not, my lights. Yeah. But I'm going to try them on and we're going to see how they fit. And we're going to try them on with that black t-shirt and the star. Here's the last outfit. It's the t-shirt with the star and the shorts. Super cute. I love the button fly. There's no front pop. Yeah, there is too. They're just kind of down on the side. And then it has back pockets. Super cute. Love them. So that's all I have for this video. I do hope that you all enjoyed it. That's Ellos, E-L-L-O-S. And be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you want to be notified each time I do a video. And you can fix it to where you be notified sometimes or always. Um, give me a thumbs up and be sure to share this video and leave me a comment on which item or piece that you liked the best. And I also want you to comment on what you would pair with how you would wear the tunic red and white striped shirt blouse. I want to know how you guys would wear it. And shoot me a picture, you know, how you think you would wear it. Find one on Pinterest that has a tunic style top like this one. And shoot me a picture of that on how you think you would wear it. But be sure to hit the subscribe button, notification bell, and for everyone that has uh, been subscribing, I will be doing a giveaway when I hit 500 subscribers, so I'm not that far away, so be sure that you are subscribed, and I will let you know which video you will have to comment on, like, and share, and be subscribed in order to be in that drawing. I will do just a regular in a box all the names drawing and i will let my granddaughter draw and then i will shoot you an email so be sure to uh, comment your email on that video as well but i'll let y'all know a little bit later on when i get closer to the 500 on what you have to do but that's all i've got for this video i love you guys bunches check me out on instagram it's mcasey 3422 and check out my poshmark i have a uh, put some new items on there as I've, I've been moving I've been getting rid of a lot of the stuff so I've got brand new items on Poshmark that's M-C-A-S-E-Y 3422 and check it out as well so until the next video that's all I've got guys I love you bunches bye